Hi there, Chris Lips here from UGCS. This is going to be the ninth video on the autopilot precision series of videos which will compare various drone autopilots by flying them the short for the ground tree route written in UGCS. In this week's video we will look at the results of another high-end drone, the MicroDrones MD4200. For analyzing the flight trajectory we will use Google Earth. Here you can see the original route. And now let's see the flight trajectory of the MicroDrone. First off, as you can see from the side view, the microdrone starts flying the route higher than the set altitude. This is due to the fact that we enabled auto mode after it was already in the air and the altitude gap is what you see in the flight. Another thing that you probably noticed is how uneven the flight trajectory seems, but pay attention to the number of points all through the route. The microdrone takes measurements very often, which in turn causes all the irregularities in the flight to show up. When looking at the flight from above, you can see that the flight trajectory is not smooth and the drone has to make various adjustments to keep itself in a straight path. The first corner is executed corresponding to the survey lines, while on the second corner you can see how the drone has diverged, leaving a gap between the survey line and the actual flight trajectory. Then moving on to the final survey line seems to have some trouble sticking to a straight trajectory in the first half of it, while the second half is similar to what you see in the first and the second survey lines. Overall, as far as precision for photogrammetry missions goes, the Macrotron still leaves something to be desired, especially when comparing it to more affordable drone autopilots, such as the Phantom 4 or the PX4 for example. And that is all for this week's video, the links for our KML files from the flight can be found in the video description below. Thank you for watching, make sure to subscribe to our channel, follow us on social media, and see you in the next week's video.